With archery season closing for elk in Colorado, our focus now shifts to chasing bull elk with a rifle. In 2022, Colorado saw an estimated 140,000 rifle elk hunters, with a success rate of about 23%. First Rifle is known in Colorado as being one of the best chances to shoot a mature bull. The elevation is perfect, just a touch right. Okay, oh, more. yeah, I know, I see it. Fire in the hole. Fire in the hole. Everybody okay? Yeah. Yep. Your odds nearly double compared to archery season. Our main goal is to manage the elk harvest and not chase these animals off the Hartice Ranch and properties. Which is 8,000 acres up here, 30 minutes from here. We're gonna put two guys over there. And that's phenomenal. And I got another 500 acre piece that's not connected, that's up the road about 10 minutes, that there's 120 elk on right now and two shooter bulls on it. So we have that also. And then we have uh, Ryan's, which there's a tank that just moved in there today that he just sent me a picture of, mm -hmm. a real good bull. And so the good thing is we have all these, I have guys out right now and we know where all these animals are. And yeah. Hit the ground right in the morning. And then it'll be, boom, we're all kind of spreading out. And then there's five different camps now. Yeah. And it's just awesome how we're stepping the game up right. and we're limiting the hunting. So it's gonna make that just so much better. And there's elk in there real religiously. So, so now it's like, instead of us hunting, you know, four guys here, five, whatever it is, four, you know, we're, we're able to now just spread things out that's all just based on quality. So first rifle season, we are careful and we are precise. With what we have built here, the odds are in our favor and we are blessed to chase elk on some of the best ranches in the West. Jim, which I think would be a great opportunity. That bull out front here is awesome. Really, really, really good bull. And I think that's a great opportunity to try to kill that bull in the morning. Sure. Yeah, we can get him killed tomorrow. I mean, morning might be tough just with the movement that's going to take place here. Yeah. But who knows? Yeah. 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 I mean, yeah, yeah. He'll be around. So he's not going to get bumped off. No. He may just get bumped in the timber in the morning. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Exactly. And we'll yeah. the pictures and we'll take Ben. Let's do it. So. Okay. Congratulations. Nice. It all worked out. Thanks, My yeah. golly, that's awesome. Good, great awesome. stock. Good oh, deal. Good, good, good. Well, I put you with the best. I know that. Uh huh. I know it too. Poor Ed. Runs up, and then you, I can tell it six. It turns and comes back down, and all the cows came Come after back. Well, well, well then. I'm over there on that road and I'm glassing. Like from the top of that road up here, I can see the cows. And they're all looking down. Yeah. And I'm like, okay, well the bull's gotta be down or he's down below him. Let's give him a minute. So we sneak down on the road and we see him and he's here and he's got his head up. And the only shot we have is through the ladder. That's amazing. <laughs> so he's trying to shoot through the ladder. <laughs> That's right here. Oh, it's shooting through the ladder. I'm like, well, you got about 12 inches. Oh my God, you're kidding me. No. And he shot through the ladder. He shot through the ladder and, and hit the elk. Yeah. That's amazing. Yeah. He had to shoot through the ladder. That's hilarious. And I'm like, <laughs> if you shoot Freddy's blind, he's gonna be mad. <laughs> Jeez, Jim, you really have some nerve willing to shoot my blind up, huh? I was gonna, I was gonna break it. I said, oh, that's all I need to go back and tell Freddy he needs a new uh, ladder on his blind. <laughs> one shot, I didn't have any opening there. Uh huh. Do one here. Yeah, I did. Okay, I knew that. Yeah, I, knew that. I think that's gonna be good. And no, not long maybe. But great thirds, great eye guards. Look how long those yeah, fronts no, are. That's crazy. Yeah, the eye guards are cool. This is my fourth time at the Hard Times Ranch. I've gotten uh, two with rifle and two with bow, including a Pope and Young that measured 396 when we brought it down. I love the guides, I love the elk, and I love the scenery. It's just the most gorgeous place in the world. As long as I can walk, I'll come back.
us for a world-class hunt and adventure, visit HarticeRanch.com. No way. Oh my gosh, are you serious? Really? You guys just not wanting to show me pictures or what? <laughs> oh, well, I wish I had pictures for you, but last night we were on uh, on a real good big bull and we tried getting on him, getting on him, and he just kept like beating us we could not get around the ridge and then uh, this morning everything was planned out and we just get across the cattle guard and I don't know if the people across the road or something took a shot early before daybreak because we had like at least what 60 80 100 100 head of elk come flying across the property and went right, right where all the other elk we were gonna go hunt this morning and they just conglomerated everything and took off and went over the ridge. The thing is, Recorder. let's go Let's go with the odds. The odds are something's gonna happen down there. And we can always come back and grab your you're, The odds are something's gonna happen. You're yeah, very you're right. That's something's Quit gonna happen. Quit being that way. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we gotta get her out. Okay, go, does go that, do it. Does it have gas? I do, I don't know about that. Does that have gas? <laughs> <laughs> Got a whole different bull arm on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's amazing. So that, so the big eight and the burger bull are somewhere up in these cubbies. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Hitting. Oh, well, I guess it'd be in those parks up in Bear Canyon where we went. Where we went with the bow? Up on those flats. Because they're there. not on, they're not on the neighbors. Because okay. hard to talk to him. He, yeah. he they didn't shoot it. They didn't get him. No, he said I have no elk on me. Well, I mean, is it worth trying that? We got too many guys. I know. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah. You guys are gonna look like a herd. Looks like a wolf. We've been, we've been elk all the time. We've been, we've been. Yeah, we've been on See, I think it's smarter to go sit over there where Kuji sat in that area, because we can glass that, because I was seeing elk up on that face, and that's where those damn things come down and out. So you want to go sit on the power line there, right? Yeah. Right, because he just sat I think, right on, he literally sat Yeah, he sat on that head. power line, right, right. And but, that's where that herd of, that whole herd of 100. And, and from there, we'd be able to hear any of these others bugling. And then let's just do that. I yeah. think that power line's I think badass. Somewhere, though, That's like around this 
this area is our best bet. But I mean, that that seems to be a corridor where that power line is, where they're back and forth, back and forth, and they're always up on that big mountain. And if they're not there, they're just over the other side. I still, I, I think we should do that. I think that's the best bet. I do. Done. A couple weeks ago, weren't they? They were up there running all over the damn place. I think they're up there. First few is that we're down here. When you're over there, you can't see back into here. It's kind of, okay. Start me to go. No, I'll go ahead. Or do you want me to go look at that? And make sure they don't come out right there. You can, you can. Whatever you want me yeah, to do. Yeah, go do it. Okay. Do you have the same phone number? Or do you have phone call? Why don't we do that? Let's just get moving on that. Might as well. Okay. Ready. We're gonna follow this draw till we hit that other draw and kind of come back and go right into them and see how much distance we can cover. Get a little closer. There's gotta be another bull in there, I would think. Because I don't know if we've seen them all. Yeah. I don't know. You know, there could be a tank. It could be that big, big, big guy in that bunch. I don't know. He's gonna call Jake. Dad, he only wants to shoot five by fives on the range. Okay, fair. They don't get antsy. They They're a mile away. They don't even think that we're yeah, going to hurt them from down here. Yeah. Awesome. 
he whacked him. Behind the bush. Huh? He's behind the yeah, bush. Yeah, yeah, He hit him off. There's cows. The cows are there. Oh, is he behind the bush right there? Wait, 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 no, wait. no, 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 no. That's, That's a cow. cow. That's a cow. Don't shoot that. Okay, okay. He drilled him. You drilled him. You did drill him. You did drill him. You drilled him. Yep, great shot. Great shot. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. Yep. Good deal. Good deal. Wow. Wow. Smoke City. Let's try to get up there before it gets dark. Yeah, I bet it. Should we just come to you? Can he see him? Come to you. We'll come to you. Goodbye. Right away. Right away. Okay, let's get across here. Yeah, I see him. Yeah. We need to get over there. I got him, yeah. Yeah. It's right here, triangle grass right there. Yeah. Right above it, okay. almost at the top, okay. in front of that sage. Just squeeze soft. Got him. Got him! Great job! Great shot! Great shot! Good job, buddy! Awesome! We freaking did it! You did it! Great bull! Oh yeah, this is a great bull. This is what we're looking for. Six. Six by six. Yeah! Awesome! Congratulations, brother. Oh, yeah. How you feel? Yeah. Probably the second, but I don't know. Good stuff. That's doesn't probably matter. the second shot, because he's got down. So, oh, yeah. Like I, I, like I was saying at dinner that, uh, I mean, literally three months ago, I was perfectly healthy, never really had any issue, and then, uh, you know, out of nowhere, I have a seizure, and, you know, you go to a hospital, they do a MRI on your brain, and they find all these tumors, and the surgeon's telling me what a great job she did. She you know, was able to take out 98% of the tumor, uh, but, you know, the only bad news is, is that, you know, you've got a glioblastoma, which is like stage four, you know, brain cancer. It's, it's here, so, you know, every day is, uh, you know, special for me. It's Thank you. Awesome Thanks all you guys. Yeah. Ben, Ty, Ed, everybody. Yeah, it was a super team effort. As we are guiding rifle hunters here on the ranch, I'm reminded that the end of the long, busy full season is near. This is one of the most sought after hunts as an outfitter because of the increased success rate. This week was a testimony to that. Thanks to the way we hunt our elk, the next couple weeks should be great as well. Hold on, let me get funny. 